Hi guys, I'm back. First of all, I want to thank you for your support and I'm happy you guys like this project as much as I do. Second of all, a small update. There will be two different Pokemon lines for each category, like the regional Rodan, regional Buck and so on. One will be a design completely made by me because I have already designed a lot of them in advance and one will be made out of your ideas. The region will be huge, so no limits. The new overall theme for the second regional Rodan is already decided. I cited the two comments in my pinned comment under this video. If you want to add your ideas to the concept, please leave your comments under the pinned one. Anyways, let's start. So my first idea I went with was basing the Route 1 Rodan on the highly endangered wild living hamsters. But it was actually a struggle to come up with a good pose since hamsters are basically cute fluff balls with tiny arms and legs. So I scrapped that idea and looked up other fitting animals from Germany. Decided I wanted to go with a groundhog because they look usual in mountain areas which I thought would be a cool part for a fake moon region to explore. Also on mountains can be quite cold, so it was the perfect chance to make a new type combination. Normal and ice. The base stage will just be normal, but the second stage will gain the ice type later. I think your home world will be located next to the mountains of the region. When you start your journey you won't be able to go into the mountains because of ongoing avalanches, but you will be able to go there later. However, during this time the first stage of the regional Roland will move into the lower parts of the region, like the route next to your home village, so you can encounter them early in the game nonetheless. This land is definitely on the cuter side, I just prefer the cute blood on Rodents. I'm just realizing that the color scheme looks a bit like normal steel. And the base stage is finished. May I present you Marmalmod, from its German name Murmeltier and Marmot, the English name. Hope the design is appealing enough for your first possible fake mod that you can encounter in this region. Let's move on to the final evolution. I struggled with the design again for quite some time. It looked like a weird cat and I didn't like that, so I started over again, even though I had already started to align the design. But I was just so unhappy that I couldn't continue. So, I used some more references and it worked out way better. At the beginning I wanted to give it a patch of grass on its back, but ice was just fitting better. Colors are nothing spectacular, just what you would imagine when thinking about a normal ice type. After I finished the colors, I actually went back to work on the outlines with the new technique that I had learned after I already finished a bunch of fake moon. You will see this in a few more videos. And here is the final evolution Avalmod, from the words Avalanche and Marmot. You will not encounter these fake men in the wild until later in the game, since they stay in the mountain all the time, but you can of course evolve your own Marmot into an Avalmod, if you want one on your team. So that's the regional role I came up with, here you can see the shiny versions. I hope you like these two fake mon, the second regional role will take some time since I have to design them first and still have other stuff to do. That's it for the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to not miss any future videos, leave your ideas for new fake mon in the comments if you have any, and I will see you soon.